D43 Studios presents The Murder of Kathy Musial, a podcast, spring 2023. Kathy Lynn Musial grew up on a farm in Du Bois, Illinois, with her mom, dad, three sisters, three brothers. The sisters described the farm as a living hell. My father was a horrible alcoholic. He had temper problems. In the mid-70s, when Kathy was around 16, her mom packed the family up and headed out of town. We all left and went to live with my Uncle Roger and Aunt Rita in Belleville. The family would only stay for a couple months before the mother decided to move back to Du Bois, but Kathy would not join them. But Mom finally decided she wanted to go back home. Okay, so it's at that point that Kathy stays and starts to establish her life there. So Kathy would get settled in and eventually enroll in the local high school. Uncle Roger and Aunt Rita enrolled her at Cahokia High School. The cover picture from this podcast features Kathy at a Cahokia High School dance. She would stay in the area with her boyfriend and make occasional visits up to the farm and to boys to see her brothers and sisters, mom and dad. It was 1978, so Joyce, the sister you've been hearing from, Explained that she didn't hear much from her sister and only seen her on these occasional visits. Until one day, while getting off the school bus. We were walking home. We got off the school bus. We were walking home back to the farm. And my brother Joe told me that Kathy got killed. On November 29th, 1978, Catherine Lynn Musial was found brutally murdered inside her home on Blue Water Lane in Cahokia, Illinois. My dad and Jesse Baugh, Chester was his official name, and I all drove to Cahokia to start moving things out of the trailer. I got to go into the trailer and see Kathy's bloody couch where she had passed away. The blood was still on everything, on the floor, everywhere. While Kathy's family dealt with the aftermath of her murder, the village of Cahokia was once again shocked with a brutal homicide, the second in less than 75 days. Carla Mallory, also 20 years old, was found stabbed and strangled in her home on Upper Cahokia Road, which was only two and a half miles away from Blue Water Lane. When did you hear about the um, the second murder that happened in, I guess it was February? Do you remember your family having a reaction to that? Or how did you guys find out? Or was it way later that you guys learned that there was a similar... The police, the police did call and tell us about that. To this day, the 1978 stabbing and strangulation of Kathy Musial and the 1979 stabbing and strangulation of Carla Mallory remain unsolved. Both of their lives cut short at just 20 years old in the small village of Cahokia, Illinois. My name's Dusty. I've teamed up with the family of Kathy Musial to take a look into the events surrounding her 1978 murder. We've already began our journey and we need your help. We want to talk to anyone that knew Kathy or has any information about anyone or anything in this case. If you have important details regarding the case, please contact your local authorities first. Follow this story on Dupo News D43 Studios Facebook page.